of Short. K1 Short has come up big this season for the Panthers. The third year pro notched 11 sacks, a franchise record for a defensive tackle, and was named to the Pro Bowl. He grew up on the tough streets of East Chicago, along with his childhood buddy, Etwan Moore, a guard for the Bulls. We grew up together, been known each other probably since we were like five years old. Um, grew up right across the street. Uh, you know, he's loving, fun, caring person, um, you know, real silly and real outgoing. You know, just happy and proud to see him win the Super Bowl. K1 and Etwan played basketball together at East Chicago Central High School, winning the 4A state championship in 2007. They both earned scholarships to Purdue and now pro athletes. Yeah, that's unlikely to happen. I mean, because growing up, um, I knew no one person that played professional sports. And, you know, we always looked up to athletes. So, you know, for us to do it and, you know, have someone for the younger guys in East Chicago look up to is great. K1 has never forgotten where he came from. He often visits his high school talking with the football team, and he posted a message on Facebook after the NFC title game thanking his hometown for the support. His athletic ability and just the type of person that he was, he was, wasn't going to let anything stop him or stand in his way from achieving any goal that he set his mind to. You know, it lets the kids here know that, you know, regardless of what obstacles or anything else that gets in their way, he was able to make it from here and so can they. These younger guys here, you know, um, everyone wants to be the next Kawan Short, you know, <laughs> so he, he opened up those doors for all those kids to let them know that if you dream big, it can become a reality and that's exactly what he's doing. In East Chicago, Megan Malachy, CBS 2 News. K1 Short definitely coming up big. His high school is going to have KS Day on Friday. And nice. the football team is going to gather at the high school to watch the Super Bowl on Sunday, of course, right here on CBS 2. Yes.